well, three more to go do, but these three are going to be together. Okay, so here's how it works. Eliminations at Fortilla. Now, I'm running this all in one video because here's how it works. If you kill a henchman at Fortilla, it counts for your seven henchmen and mortars. It also counts for your plus four players. So you can go into Fortilla and Team Rumble and go kill some people. That's cool, but it's not going to count. If you go into solos, duels, or squads, and you go in and kill henchmen, then you're good. Because they'll count for all three. Let me show you how this is done. Let's get it going. Alright, we're going to drop into Fortilla here in a second, and all we're going for is henchmen. Because once we go for the henchmen, it will count for all three of them. Now, the best place to do henchmen is not in Fortilla. If you're trying to get the seven done, the best place to drop is actually into uh, Kitty Corner, or go into the Authority. That's the best two places with the most henchmen to get to. The Fortilla is kind of slacking on henchmen, but there's enough henchmen around in the Fortilla that we can actually get some kind of henchmen kills. All you need is three kills in the Fortilla, so three henchmen leave you four when you have to go kill henchmen. And then it gives you four on your 70 for your team event. So it's not too hard to go do. Um, if you do it the right way, you can double up on these and get them done get them done quick oh uh, it's just all the way across the map for me but I mean that's not too bad now when the kills are done you have to be inside the portilla if you want to stop and drop and get a weapon on your way in like I'm going to go do there's nothing wrong with that except I got mortars on me too Always a good time around here. If you can kill seven henchmen, though, you're good. Better. the Fortilla that I'm playing with right now and the reason why I still technically consider that is because it's uh, over the line obviously if there's a henchman chain booth then you're good now I should be able to walk right by these henchmen and that's good because what I'm trying to do is walk right up to them So run through the buildings, collect your guns. They have to have a kill on them. So finish them all the way out. Now I'm basically just looking for a henchman.
sure you finish out each and every one so it counts, just in case. Because now that you see somebody else is here, it could be kind of screwed up. You know, if somebody else kills you, you want to make sure you've got them in those management yourself. I'm not sure how many henchmen are still left, but it's always a good idea just to walk around and check while I'm in the storm. It's going to kill me out anyways. Well, it looks like we got them all. That's the way to get your three henchmen. And start knocking off the rest of your levels and that's all we got for this video.